Well, hello there, hello you. Welcome to my channel. You are here with me, Coax47. And today we're here with uh, Ace Combat 7, uh, the Top Gun Maverick edition that I had. I uh, just want to give a little little look. It's going to be, it's not going to be the same as actually being in VR, but I just wanted it to be up on the channel. I just thought it was a bit of fun and just, uh, just to mess around. I'm currently playing a different game mode in VR, um, where I just get to watch jets take off. You hear Mobius One? You must really like flying to watch us train on a day off. Well, I guess you're different from the other guys. Since you're here, why don't you call the aerial maneuvers? Omega Squadron, you heard that? Omega Two, Roger. Omega Three, Roger that. You're right, though. How's it going, bud? <laughs> Commence touch and go. What's he doing? This eh? exercise has the plane landing, then taking off without stopping. Look at him go. I can also come down here. Or over here? Why would I want to go over here? Or over here? Oh. Oh, down here. Oh, shit. Commence loop. What? The loop is a basic maneuver that various strategies are derived from. Any of you guys ever been to any air shows? Used to love having a couple of points and down the beach. Go watch the planes fly by like lovely. Right, so I can call out stuff for them as well. See you properly now. That's pretty cool, man. That's Shandell. Now we're on slice back. Commit slice back. This maneuver has the plane bank at negative 45 degrees from level into an oblique descending loop. Just, uh, just so you guys know, I uh, trained these pilots myself. You know. Uh, I'm, I'm quite the, uh, quite the, uh, the flyer myself. Uh. Come in, Simmel man, turn. Simmel man, turn. The has the plane continually pitching directly upward, allowing it to swiftly turn 180 degrees. Come on. Up next. Split this. Okay, here we go. Command split S. Here the plane pitches downward, allowing it to turn 180 degrees without slowing down. 
Oh boy. Pretty cool, huh? Up, up next is the Hi Yo Yo, and, and then Commence the Hi Yo Yo. When a plane is faster than an enemy, use this maneuver to ascend and drastically decelerate. It's almost like, um, it's almost kind of like dogfighting tactics as well, like, as well as the, the displays. We all know the barrel roll, come on now. Commence barrel roll. This maneuver utilizes both upward rolling pitch to fly the helical path. That's awesome, man. The scissoring. Here we go. Now. <laughs> this maneuver has the plane turn sharply, then meander, forcing an enemy in front. It's effective for switching to offense. Pretty good, ne? Hey, what do you think? Are you bored? I've seen this too much in you. How many maneuvers are there? Jesus. Knife edge. Commence knife edge.
Cobra. Commence Cobra. This maneuver has the plane pitching upward to an elevation angle of around 90 oh. degrees. Didn't even know planes could do that shit. The hook. Commence hook. It's easier if I called it a cobra and double turning flight. How'd you get a plane to do that shit? <laughs> Up next. Colbert. Commence Colbert. This maneuver has the plane perform a tight move as the medium is Oh my lord, have mercy. You two go and fucking kill each other now, I swear. Accidents happen during this kind of shit. Gonna be mopping up all of you all over this fucking place. Look. Pieces of you don't name. Pieces of you don't name. Commence double Corbett. Oh fucking hell. This maneuver is two Corbett's performance in succession. It's hard to believe planes can do it. I'm sorry, what? Did I I just watched the jet. Fuck off. There's no way jets can do that in real life. Piss off. No fucking way. I'm watching three jets doing fucking double backflips in the air. Piss off. No way. It's not happening. Sorry. No. This exercise has the plane landing, then taking off without stopping. How about that? That was fucking awesome. So we went through them all. See you later, buddy boy. Enjoy the show. I got some flying to do. Okay, so we'll, we'll actually take off now. <laughs> Come on. I'm only going to go on easy. Just to, just to show off a little little taste of it as well. Because uh, it's not going to be the same as actually being in VR anyway. But, I mean, you know. If you kind of like the look of it. It's a good uh, good game for VR. Good fun. Very strangely real. Like, weirdly realistic being in the cockpit. Okay, so I'm gonna get, uh, just gonna do mission one. Let's begin the briefing. The Baden Peninsula radar site to the northwest of us here at Fort Grace has picked up a number of unidentified aircraft. They've ignored all warnings from the IUNPKF and are making their way towards our base. As the IUN has air traffic control over all of Yuja, we're almost certain the crafts belong to the Free Illusions. You guys will scramble immediately, visually identify the aircraft, and then use your radios to order them to land. If attacked, you have permission to engage them in combat. Waste no time destroying them. Alright. So I've got a choice between... This thing... Or this thing. I kind of like the second one. I mean, look at the stats in it. I mean, you don't get stats in real life, you know, like that, but still. Right, we'll use this. Okay. Sorry. 
Now, I can't add music to my videos because I just don't have that kind of... I don't, I don't have a computer or anything to edit my videos in that way. Uh, if I found a way to edit music into my videos, believe me, I'd have, like, Kenny Loggins playing in the background right now. Northeast 1, do you copy? You're clear for takeoff immediately after Omega 11. Right, yo, boy. Fucking bushes in the distance going no, all over this. Control. The wind direction is 130 degrees at a speed of 18 knots. We're good right. for takeoff. Where's the other boy? Mobius One, you were cleared for takeoff. Let's get in here. Mobius One, takeoff confirmed. Altitude restriction lifted. Good luck out there. This is AWACS, Sky Eye of the 118th Tactical Fighter Wing. You'll be under our command from here on out. Omega 11, follow Mobius One. This could turn into a firefight. I hope this guy's the real deal. You'll find out if he is soon enough. Everyone will. Looks like we got company over here then. Picking up several unidentified aircraft. Omega 11, try contacting them via radio. Unidentified aircraft. This is the IUN PKF. Unidentified aircraft has a radar lock on us. Missile. Bandits fired. Missile. The unidentified aircraft are confirmed. Oh, you want to play? Okay. Weapons free. Engage. Don't let them near the base. Woo! We're picking up 
something new on radar. Our reinforcements are here. We got the upper hand now. Roger. Got you. Lever two, can you look after yourself for a bit? I'll watch your backs too. Look up. Collapse for commonness. Enemy on your sick. Stand it down, confirm. Visibility in the clouds is poor. Watch yourself. Be careful not to ice up. Reduce my speed. Unable to confirm target hit. You wanna play, huh? Baby, let's do this. Mobius one again. Mega eleven, pay attention. Stop staring at Mobius one. Mega two, it's just a decoy. Hey, we missed down. Good night. Constantly watch my ass. There's an enemy unit approaching the base. Take it out. like 70 odd missiles left so <laughs> might as well use them up Dive down to come on viper 2 keep up we have to do this for who's your sick find the leader but who is the leader Alright, alright, alright. Two targets remaining. Now it's shut down. 
target remaining. Watch all you like. There will be more battles. Until then, we rest. Return to base. Oof, I took some hits on that one. Jesus. Still alive, though. This is the control tower of Fort Grace. AWACS Sky Eye, we'll take it from here. Over. Two miles to runway. You're too fast. Lower your airspeed. One mile to runway. You're right on course. Just keep it steady. Oof. Your altitude's too low. Raise your nose. I know, I know, I know. Landing confirmed. That was a textbook landing. Nice work. Now go and get some rest before your next sortie. All right, man. Back in the fucking hangar. Thanks to your efforts, the unidentified Look at this, rank C. Unbelievable, man. I think it's because you need to go through it without getting hit. Which is difficult. It's especially difficult when you're not just playing the game. I mean, look at my scoring. It's like C and B and C. I mean, at least I had a fucking... Let's get on with the briefing. 1816 Bomber Squadron is almost here. However, we got a report of what seemed to be free erosion aircraft approaching them. Air intercept is at the squadron's ETA. Your mission is to ensure our air superiority around the base and to protect the bombers. Mm -hmm. As of now, we cannot tell whether they're after the bombers or this base. Be ready to take on anything thrown at you. Right. Don't worry, buddy. I got this. What's this? Yeah, I mean, there's more missiles now. Air to, air to ground. Yeah, I need more air to ground on this one. Whew. All right. This one, sorry. Come on with the loading screens, man. E-52 is making an emergency landing. Clear the runway. Prioritize Mobius-1. I'm going up first. Good. You can launch together. Mobius-1, formation takeoff. Go up next to the fighter.
Get me up in the fucking air. Restriction lifted. Excellent takeoff. We're counting on you. Interceptors inbound. You idiots are late. This is Viper 2. Bandit acquired. All aircraft cleared hot. A bandit has a lock on you. Lock on. This is Sky Eye requesting takeoff clearance. Denied. Not clear. Copy that tower. Okay, but my wings are icing up. Stay with me. Bandit acquired. Attacking. Bandit in my sight. Leg 11. Attack missed. I'm taking damage. We're getting locked. Breaking away. They're seeming. Be alert. Mobius 1, you've been fighting. Missile. Missile on its way. Detection range has expanded. Picking up enemy ground forces in area around East Substation. That substation powers the base. Defend the substation immediately. Not that fucking pylon. 
Back to missiles. Enemies after the substation have been destroyed. Start the safety check. Make sure you're extra careful when you turn the electricity back on. Those guys are putting their lives at risk protecting us. Let's get this place back online. Wait, what's this? All aircraft. The base is under attack from enemy ground units. Return immediately. It seems this was the enemy's objective all along. Alright, well they'll they'll get a fucking missile up the arse then. Let's take another nine to use. Locked on bandit. Aircraft overhead! Busted. We need to support our assault force. Prepare anti aircraft. I can hear aircraft. They must have found our position. Prepare the AA. Something appeared on radar. Enemy reinforcements are approaching the base. Take them down. All aircraft, prioritize the air superiority. We can beat them. Don't let them damage more. Missile. If we lose the base, it's Missile. all over. Missile. Use normal rounds now. Normal fucking missiles. Man, those are uh, four AGMs are fucking really good. were completely eliminated. Well, we had 
an amazing pilot too. Victory is ours. Let's see him try that again. Man, it's good fun. It's a good feel being like the whole cockpit the thing. Everything is so detailed. And... Understood. But the guy who got us into the sky is the real MVP behind this victory. Clear the runway debris. I wish there was a way that we everybody could like crashing on landing. have the experience of of watching VR stuff like this from a, from a YouTuber's videos. But like just having that experience for yourself as well at home without having the game, you know. I mean, I suppose you could. There are videos out there. There's a whole VR section if you uh, get yourself a VR headset. I'm trying to reduce my speed, but because my nose is down, I'm fucking. Yeah, 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 yeah. Don't worry. Don't worry about it. I fucking I've landed plenty of planes. You're past the guidance limit. Make a visual landing. Landing confirmed. That's a perfect landing, Mobius One. Thanks for the excellent work. Rest up until the next mission. Impressive, right, Mobius One. Bike. The other pilots will follow your example. Let me guess. I had a fucking C or something. I don't know. It's all because that guy hit me once. Oh man. And it's because I keep forgetting to use my flares all the time. A major operation I had an E. Damn. Around. Nice. Nice to see. Yeah, I, yeah, I get the idea. You can now use the E. 10 C aircraft. You can use um, fuck you know. Oh, I got a new plane. So have a look at the new plane at least. And I want to see what it's like inside. So I'll do that that last bit. Man, I, I can do so much better on this. This is heavy because the fighter is loaded with heavy weaponry. Oh, the oh yeah, fucking hell! I've seen this plenty of times. Uh, it's not great for speed. It's got a hundred missiles. Unguided bombs are uh, affected against clustered surface. Uh, so it's ground stuff that that's really best for then. them on nice okay let's go fuck these guys up just want to get up there and try and at least get an E on this don't get hit come on man I suppose playing this on like hard difficulty is probably the best way to go if you want realism because I suppose if you get hit once, that's it, you're done, you know, it would be like that in real life, so. Let's fuck one, these you're dudes up. You're clear for takeoff immediately after Omega 11. I wish that there was more to it on the VR side of things, but you can also play the game without VR, and so I guess no, that's like where the... The wind direction is 130 degrees at a speed of 18 knots. Yeah, yeah. We're good for takeoff. I guess that's where like the story is of the Ace Combat games. I, like, I haven't followed no, any of them, so... For takeoff. I just wanted to play... I, I literally bought this game just for the VR side of it. Get these on, because I am going to fuck one, take off confirmed. Up. Altitude restriction lifted. Good luck out there. This 
is AWACS, Sky Eye of the 118th Tactical Fighter Wing. You'll be under our command from here on out. Omega-11, follow Mobius-1. This could turn into a firefight. I hope this guy's the real deal. You'll find out if he is soon enough. Everyone will. We're picking up several unidentified aircraft. Omega-11, try contacting them via radio. Unidentified aircraft. This is the IUN PKF. Unidentified aircraft has a radar lock on us. Missile. Bandit fired. Missile. The unidentified aircraft are confirmed Missile. hostile. Weapons free. Missile. Engage. Missile. Missile. Don't let them near the base. Missile. Okay. Missile. Missile. Come on! Get that son of a bitch! Yes! Oh, you bastard! You think you could have had me from behind, huh? Stall warning. Not happening. Fucking bastard, look at you. Missile hit. Have it fucking back. Right. Formation. You're new here, so I'll fill you in. This guy's the real deal. I can't stand on time with pilots. Such candor. Haven't you said too much? I'll be the judge of that. We're picking up something new on radar.
Looks like we're going high in the sky for this one. Spot trails. Watch all you like, there will be more battles. Until then, we rest. Return to base. <sighs> okay. This is the control tower at Fort Grace. AWAC Sky Eye, we'll take it from here. Over. Two miles to runway. You're too fast. Lower your airspeed. Don't worry about me, boy. Good. One mile to runway. Your altitude's too low. Raise your nose. Don't worry about me. Landing confirmed. Nice job, Mobius One. That was a thing of beauty. Nice work. Now go and get some rest before your next sortie. I only took like one hit, so... Uh, those missiles are a lot handier. Pretty cool. So I'm guessing that you only get these like three missions, but like if you replay them, you're gonna get some new jets and some new... new, uh... weaponry. I guess it's good in that sense, really, because you, the more you do them, the more you know what's coming. Yeah, look, I had an ear, and that one, well, that was nice. So what I get? I get something nice, huh? Give me a new plane. Hmm? I could choose a new plane. No new, no new plane, okay. 
Alright then, well, um, thank you. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch the video if you did. Um, yeah, uh, that was Ace Combat 7, Clear Skies. Uh, good fun, good fun in VR. Uh, takes a bit of getting used to if you're, you know, very great with VR. Um, controls are, are, like, are pretty much everything that you've flown-wise in games are, 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 are like that. So, it's all easy and recognisable. Um, I highly recommend to go and get the game if you like the look of it. Like I say, you only get the three missions and then you have to play like the main story in like normal mode without VR. So, I don't know, I mean, you, you're, taking your, you're taking your chances on it with what you like as a game. But, yeah, I mean, it's good fun. Thank you for taking the time to watch the video. Please uh, subscribe to my channel if you you like the look of any of my videos. Um, and, uh, yeah. I will see you in the next video, then. See you later.